police call to the home of George Zimmerman's wife after she makes this terrified sounding 911 call. I don't know what he's capable of. I'm really, really scared. You can hear Shelly Zimmerman, who filed for divorce from George last Thursday, describe what she calls the assault. He punched my dad in the nose. My dad has a mark on his face and then took my iPad out of my hand and smashed it and cut it. With a pocket knife. At about 2 p.m., Shelly Zimmerman told police she had come with her father to their house to pick up her things when the altercation began, saying Zimmerman had his hand on his gun, threatening them. He continually has his hand on his gun, and he keeps saying, step closer, step closer, and he's going to shoot us. After police arrive, eight units, you hear Shelly break down. Oh, my God. Police say Zimmerman told them he had acted in, quote, a defensive manner and, quote, never had his hand on his gun, and that both sides accused the other of being the aggressor. It's Zimmerman's latest tangle with the law. Just last week, he was slapped with a $250 speeding ticket. Here's why I stopped you for speed. Sorry. Barely two weeks after this murder acquittal for shooting and killing Trayvon Martin, Zimmerman was stopped for speeding on a Texas highway. And just days ago, this explosive interview with his wife, Shelly, just after she filed for divorce. In my opinion, he feels more invincible. Police say for now, there will be no charges in this latest incident. Zimmerman is free to go once again. Matt Gutman, ABC News, Miami.